you get here by coming down Jordan Street, which is right there from downtown, and then Deer Creek is down that direction. My name is Richard Baker, and I'm one of the artists in the Art Onsite Tribute Trail project in Nevada City. The title of the project is Unused Pieces, and it's a photography project. I'm trying to, over the course of the year, define the trail by its inhabitants, all the animals and insects and birds, as well as the people that use the trail. So I've got a camera down, down there in the woods attached to a tree, and it's down there because there's a pretty well-used um, animal trail right here that I was attracted to, and it's kind of you know close to the sewage treatment plant and the, and the trail as well, so it kind of gathers a lot of information about like what kind of animals and people and stuff are moving through this area. So I'm gonna go down there and check it right now. So these cameras are um, motion sensitive and when something walks in front of it, they take a series of three photographs. I used to tie fishing flies and um, kind of just make like craft projects around the house when I was a kid. Got interested in photography in high school and then um, studied photography at UC Santa Cruz and got interested in conceptual art by a sort of chance meeting with an artist from San Francisco named David Ireland. The name Unused Pieces comes from a conversation that I was having with David when he was passing away basically and it was one of the last things that he said to me. I asked him how he was doing and he said he was filled with unused pieces and I thought it was a really um, an interesting quote so I'm using it on this and kind of, you know, thinking about David and my relationship with him and art making and it's been a long time since I've made it so it kind of was a comfortable place to be. Like as soon as this project started that whole Edward Snowden thing happened and I started having to be really thoughtful about, you know, people's privacy and the whole like NSA discussion that's happening. and. Um, I don't know, it just changed my whole sort of thoughts about utilizing images of people. And I mean, like that one catches people walking by. So any pictures of people that I've used so far is really just pieces and parts of people, not like recognizable aspects of them. So I don't know, I'm not sure what to do about <laughs> imagery from that one. I think this used to be what they called the Excelsior Ditch. I don't think it's been functional for years, but it'll be interesting to see, you know, what transpires over the course of 12 months. I mean, so far I've started my blog and I've had some good um, reaction to that. And then I'm going to have a show at a local restaurant called Mateo's in downtown Nevada City. So people will be able to see kind of in a more traditional environment what the imagery looks like and what kind of things are happening out here. One of the cool things about this project is just the fact that we're going to be putting artwork on the trail is going to draw people out to sort of see what the trail is. I mean, I think, you know, we get sort of used to kind of going places where we go and being places where we are and don't really think to kind of get out and check places like this out. And I think that this will kind of give people some impetus to get out and take a walk and um, maybe try and find a camera and, or go and see some of the work that's on the trail on the other side of the creek.